I know this week and this weekend represent a challenging and complicated time for people of faith. The minister at our church always refers to this time of year as his Super Bowl. But not this year. For me, this will be the first Easter I haven't spent with either my mom or dad in at least 50 years. And I'm sure my dad and I will talk on the phone, but it will certainly not be the same. And it's cruel that at a time when we need hugs the most, staying apart is the most important thing that we can do for one another. This week, for our friends celebrating Easter and Passover, this week is about beating cruelty with love. We remember how to confront fear with faith. And regardless of whether you celebrate a holiday this week or not, we've all been doing a lot of that for the past few weeks, fighting a cruel force with love for one another and faith that what we do today will make tomorrow better. Now is not the time to give up or give in. Now is the time to help each other, to help the elderly, to help our frontline workers, to help those battling sickness. And we do that by sticking with what we know works and following through and staying together.